Hey guys, P. Dave, it's uh, 6 16, 16th, oh my gosh, 2021, so Wednesday night, I'm just sitting here, sitting around, um, not doing too much, I had to cook food for the dogs and stuff, Tanner got a bath today, and it was kind of a stressful day for him, um, and uh, he did good though, he did really good, um, I'm proud of him, and uh, we stopped at Dairy Queen to get him a pup cup, on the way home is a little treat for him so he deserves it uh, anyway we're going camping in a couple weeks uh, we'll have to see how that goes so they're gonna have their thugs up there they got their thugs up there you know got their thugs up there harassing nonviolent people nonviolent we're nonviolent harassing nonviolent people you know go do this to somebody who will kick your ass go do this to somebody who will kick your ass go do this to a big bad biker you know in a biker club and and see how far you get you meth heads you know they're all meth heads in my program anyway they look like they've been through the shit so anyway I hate perps I hate them I hate them you know I think they deserve to be tortured I think they deserve to go through this program I think they deserve to be squashed, you know. I'm not going to sit here and pray for these guys. Um, sorry, I'm a little, you know, because I don't like these perps. Um, they deserve everything that's coming to them, and uh, it will come to them one of these days. So anyway, um, not much going on. Uh, I got hit um, all morning. Um, I was able to get to sleep a little bit. But they were making me run to the bathroom. This guy's obsessed. I'm telling you. The guy's obsessed with my balls. They make me run to the bathroom. And he's obsessed with make my feet itch. And make my private parts itch. And all this stuff. Make my butt itch. You know, the guy's obsessed with it. You know, it's all they do. You know, they get off on this stuff. You know, it's a big joke. Um, it's going to be a really big joke someday when these guys are next. Um, these guys don't know what's going on um they could be next tomorrow they could be next tomorrow you know they think they're above the law and, and protected and all this stuff um they could be next tomorrow you know um i think they're stupid ignorant arrogant idiots they could be next tomorrow they could be next tomorrow um anyway um so that's what went on today. I'm just sitting here now, trying to relax a little bit and hanging out with Tanner and and stuff. And um, uh, you know, it's not much going on. Um, you know, you you always think about the program. You always think about these idiots, these idiots that are on these calls and in these chat rooms and all this stuff. They're idiots. They're they think they're untouchable. And they might be for a few minutes. You know, when I was um, going to pick up Tanner, there was a, I don't know if he was a perp, but he probably was a perp, um, racing down the road, going in and out of, out of traffic and all this stuff like a crazy person. Um, I think he was a perp, driving a shitty vehicle. They find these guys that can't get jobs, and they use them once or twice or three times to get reactions out of you um but they're losers they can't get a job you know worth of anything you know they can never pass a back background check never do it you know um they haven't given back to society in their whole damn life you know so and um oh, i was going to tell you guys about something else Okay, oh, I'll tell you about this. Okay, now, if you hop on those calls and all this stuff, you know, people give misinformation. Some people don't want to believe it, but they are misinformation agents, okay? They tell you to shut off all your electricity, keep the fridge running and all that stuff. Oh, shut off all your electricity. You go into a different room and they're not hitting you in a... That's BS, you guys. We have a stream of energy that you cannot break. Attached to our brain all the time. You cannot break that stream of energy. Okay? 
Now, you can't go into a different room with no electricity and not get hit. It doesn't work that way. Um, I'll tell you, I'll tell you what happened. We lost power for over an hour the other day, uh, day before yesterday, uh, which was Monday. I believe it was Monday. We lost power. 2,000 people lost power in our neighborhood, okay? I was still getting hit. Still getting hit. Still getting hit like normal. They were still hitting me. Um, it doesn't matter if you shut your breakers off or not. You know, they will still hit you. You can't move to a different room and get away from this. This stream of energy that is on our head follows us around all the time. Even Duncan said, you cannot break that stream of energy. You know, so we can we can't get away from this. We can't get away from this. Um, you know, I mean, look at some people travel around the world and they can't get away from this. There's a stream of energy on their head all the time, on their brain. You know, so that doesn't work. You know, uh, shut your electricity off. Going to the basement. Going to the basement doesn't work. I've tried that. I still get hit the same. Um, going to uh you know shutting your electricity off and trying that it doesn't work it doesn't work um you can't move out of the way and them not hit you you can, it does it doesn't work like that you know we are filled with misinformation agents that are full of crap magnets people swear on magnets i have strong magnets they do not do anything they do not do anything you know, I have strong magnets. They don't do anything for me. Nothing. It was a waste of money. Um, you know, and stuff. And, and, you know, they want us to waste our money. They want us to be broke. That's the goal. They want us to be broke so we can't fight back. You know, that's the goal. So anyway, uh, that's what's going on tonight. Um, I suppose I'll cut this off. Uh, you know, you guys have a good night, and I'll, I guess I'll talk to you guys later.